in my mind, there is no doubt that the theory of flight gives us Helena Bonham Carter's most underrated performance. This is such an emotional, powerful film. And I think the film itself is pretty underrated. It's got 2.5 thousand reviews on IMDb, which is a pretty decent amount. But I feel like I don't know anybody personally who's seen it or even heard of it. Definitely one that needs to be seen. This was released in 1998, directed by Paul Greengrass, written by Richard Hawkins, and stars, of course, HBC and Kenneth Branagh. And the description from IMDb actually feels like more of a tagline. This is, two miserable people find happiness together, a man dreaming of flying and a woman dreaming of living. Helena Bonham Carter plays Jane. Kenneth Branagh plays a character called Richard. And... Helena's character is dying from motor neuron disease and she meets Richard and I have to point out that sign sounds quite depressing straight away and certainly without question it has its moments where the mood is very low and it's it's very hard hitting but it's also a comedy and I know that doesn't sound like it would be the case but it is and it works very well I have to say they've taken this very intense subject matter and and made it tastefully funny and her desire in life before she dies is to lose her virginity and initially I won't say too much about what happens but initially it looks like Richard might be the one to help out but he doesn't help in the way that one might expect and they both kind of help each other through their own difficult times and their own friendship blossoms And it's really, really powerful and so emotional and the character development is amazing. But ultimately, for me, Helena Bonham Carter as Jane Hatcher is incredible. Her performance is so underrated. And I know I'm slightly biased because I love her beyond words, but this is one of the best performances I've ever seen. And in fact, across all of her films, I'd say... The only other performance she's done that comes close to this level of emotion would be in Eleanor and Colette, or 55 Steps. It's, you know, it's raw, it's brutal, it's hard to watch, but it's really heartwarming. It's definitely a film that needs to be seen to be truly felt and truly appreciated. I completely recommend it. I will not say anything about what happened between Hannah Bonham Carter and Kenneth Branagh because... Well, it's irrelevant to the film itself. But obviously this film perhaps changed the course of certain actors' careers, which is very interesting. But it's an absolutely brilliant film, very well edited, very well directed. Brilliant, some brilliant, brilliant shots in this one. The character development's great. Obviously Branagh's good. HBC's performance is just out of this world. It's such a stunning, stunning film. <laughs>